time for some holiday movie action and to talk some loyalty program with our friends at Harkins Theater. Joined by Taylor Ketchum, great to see you. Good to see you. You looking forward to Thanksgiving? I am, I'm very excited yeah, for It's this. a busy time of year for you. You mm -hmm. have a lot going on, including with Harkins Theater. Uh, and they have plenty of things for the entire holiday family, including some cool Tuesday night classics that we'll talk about tonight as we tape this on Tuesday, November 22nd, and then next week, and then uh, a good family-friendly movie that people might want to take their families to. Yeah, this is a big time for Bricktown alone. There's right. a ton of stuff going on with downtown in December, and we always like being part of it um, because so many people come down and see the lights. We always have that tradition that every Tuesday you can come and see that $5 movie, and during the holiday season we always show holiday favorites. Uh, so that's always a, a big fun and a tradition for a lot of families here in Oklahoma. And one of the big Thanksgiving type movies is Planes, Trains, and Automobiles, and that will be showing tonight, mm -hmm. Tuesday night, uh, November 22nd again. Yes, with Steve Martin. We show this every year. Um, people just really love this ideal Thanksgiving movie. Of course, with John Candy, it's I mean, it's just one that people just uh, it's still quote it. Absolutely, I was about call to say, it one we all of. Kind of know the quotes. Know the quotes. Know it. It is rated R, so we always like to remind people that because they probably saw it a long time ago. They don't remember it is rated R, so not for the whole family. <laughs> but you know what, this is a fun date night. A lot of people are kind of having this week off. This would be a fun thing to do. It's always at seven o'clock, always only $5. And we have plenty of parking behind us, which is free. Very good. Looking ahead to next weekend, though, or next Tuesday, uh, Polar Express. Yeah, this one's, uh, for a lot of kids, this has become a, a favorite to see uh, right around the Christmas time. And right after Thanksgiving, you know, people are anxious to, to get into the Christmas spirit. Right. And so this is a great way to do that. Um, of course, it is voiced by a lot of the characters by Tom Hanks. Mm -hmm. A lot of people don't realize that he actually voices many people in it. But it's about a, uh, a child that gets on a train to go to the North Pole. The visuals are absolutely breathtaking, um, but what's great is they actually get to see Santa deliver that first gift. So it's truly that book uh, brought to life uh, in a new digital animated way. You know, I've never seen Polar Express. Uh, it's one you have to see. Kids, <laughs> no kids. It's one that's great to see uh, no matter your age. Talking with Taylor Ketchum, we're talking to Harkins Theaters. Mm -hmm. The information we have here can be found online at harkinstheaters.com. Uh, one of the uh, big movies right now is Fantastic Beasts and where to find them. I mean, this is one that we've been really excited about. Uh, when the Harry Potter kind of saga ended, that was a, a big thing for a lot of people. A lot of people grew up with that for right. over a decade, and then to kind of get hinted that something else was coming. Uh, so they've really added another chapter, but the chapter's actually decades before this Harry Potter world and based in New York City. So it's about the Wizarding World happening in New York City. A lot of familiar faces. Eddie Redmayne plays the main character who is a kind of magic zoologist. So in his suitcase when he comes to New York City is full of these fantastic beasts. Uh, a What we call is a muggle if you're a Harry Potter fan. <laughs> releases it without uh, meaning to do so and the movie is about uh, kind of collecting back um, before humans actually hurt them. It's not the kind of the other way around. But what's great is that Fantastic Beast, uh, the book that it's uh, kind of all about that's being developed is actually one of the main courses that Harry Potter takes. So there's a lot of kind of uh, transferred uh, kind of thought processes. A lot of people are going to be really excited about it. The spells and keywords are the same. So if you really were a Harry Potter fan, um, it is a different story, but still by J.K. Rowling that I paint people are going to be really excited about it. It's been uh, one of our favorites uh, here at the theater. Very good. You can find that in Bricktown, the Harkins Theater. Now, it is the holiday season, so perhaps mm -hmm. you should go more than once. And in fact, you should invest in perhaps the loyalty program. Yeah, this is a great way uh, to knock a few people off your Christmas list if you if you need to get a quick gift. And what's nice about it is it's the gift that keeps giving. Uh, every time you come in with our cup, it's a dollar fifty refill. So really easy, uh, makes it uh, pretty uh, easy on the wallet as well. And what's on the cups? On the cups, this is my favorite. Every year we kind of put a different types of artwork on it, but it always kind of depicts the movies that are coming the next year. And this one we did kind of class of 2017. So some ideal characters and kind of what they would be in a yearbook. So gotcha. we know Beauty and the Beast is coming out this year. Um, so Belle is kind of listed as the Glee Club president. So she's seeing. So there's a lot of fun things to do that uh, with your kids, maybe kind of go around and kind of guess what movies and uh, see if you kind of agree with the descriptions. But Very cool. Those what, are a $1.50? Do, uh, $1.50 50 refill to buy the cup refill. the first time, $6. Gotcha. So really does keep on giving. 
The t-shirt, what's uh, really nice about this, it's still a free, free medium popcorn. So every time you come in, you just bring or wear the t-shirt and you're gonna get that free medium popcorn. Uh, these are really easy stocking stuffers, holiday party host gifts. If you're doing Secret Santa, uh, if you're doing like a gift exchange for a holiday party, don't think about it. Everybody, if they're uh, supporters of kind of Things downtown, this is a fun activity to do. Uh, that not only is great for the holidays, but uh, into the new year. It's the gift that keeps giving, as you mentioned. And if you're going to a party or perhaps hosting a party, mm -hmm. maybe you need some popcorn. Yeah, this is fun. I mean, we have so many people that um, always ask, can I, can I take some popcorn home? And it's, so they might get their own personal bag, but we always suggest getting the big <laughs> bag because this is going to last you for a while. Uh, of course, it's only $10, but it feeds 10 people. Uh, some people do this when they walk into the theater, but some people buy a bag when they're walking out. <laughs> um, you can always come in just to get the loyalty items or just the big party popcorn. Uh, we do have that parking around the corner and behind uh, our building. So if you just need a run in after work, we can help you right up in guest services. We should remind people that you have a kid area as well. Yeah, we have our play center, which is really great. Uh, during this holiday season, some parents have some time off, go see a movie, but still make it a fun uh, day or date out in Bricktown. Uh, they can stay in the play center uh, between the ages of three through eight. Uh, you're still in the theater, you get a little pager, and if anything happens, you get buzzed, but they're having a blast. They get to watch kid-appropriate movies, cool. uh, they get to play games, uh, and just kind of have fun, but it is a, a safe, uh, protected area. Um, just like if you're dropping them off at uh, a daycare, but uh, it's a lot cheaper, only $6. So um, much cheaper than hiring, hiring a babysitter. And yeah, no doubt. Have it, but you can still have the kids come down and see the lights and see everything down in Bricktown, but go see a movie that maybe you want to go see that's PG-13 or rated R that maybe not be uh, appropriate for the little ones. She jokes about this feeding a cast of thousands, but in a, in a newsroom anywhere, uh -huh. yeah, it, they go fast, they go fast. Mm -hmm. All right, again, the, the Tuesday night classics uh, tonight, planes, trains, and automobiles, $5 starts at 7 o'clock next week, is Polar Express and Fantastic Beasts, and where to find them, the spotlight movie, if you will, showing at Harkins Theater, which you can find online at Harkins Theaters. Dot com. Taylor, always good to see you. Good to see you. And we really encourage everybody to check out our website. We have a really fun holiday uh, Tuesday Night Classic lineup for December as well. So every Tuesday, just kind of make that tradition and go see another holiday movie that maybe you haven't seen in a while. Very good. Happy Thanksgiving and happy holidays. You as well.